Hey everyone, I'm Mark Wim from dinokiablog.com. I have the Samsung Focus here in my hand. So on the home screen, you only have two screens. That's uh, the tiles and the list view over here. Okay, so in this video, I want to show you the integration of uh, on Windows Phone. It's it's pretty, it's very different from other phones that I've had. So um, here's the first thing: is the People Hub. Usually, you have uh, a contacts application and I'll show your telephone numbers for your friends but here on Windows Phone uh, the people hub it grabs all your uh, your friends from Facebook Twitter or other accounts that you added um, to the phone and um, so for example let's go to someone we know here let's go to let's click on chance it works for Nokia Okay, so here you see his phone number, and uh, you can even write on his wall, send him an email, his home address, and all this info here is taken from, are taken from Facebook and the Google Sync account that I've added to Windows Phone. Here, if you swipe over, it will show his um, status, and this is grabbed from his Facebook. You'll see that he just checked into In-N-Out Burger. And he uploaded a few photos. Um, okay, this is another cool thing. Windows Phone will actually grab his photo albums from Facebook and show it within the People Hub application. So here you have you see a lot of photo albums. We'll just uh, take a look at this one. So we're not used to. I'm not used to this because in most other phones that we have, we're just used to getting. Um, people's telephone number and their profile photos. So another integration that I want to talk to you about on Windows Phone is the the Me Hub or I don't know what it's called but it's it says Me on it. I guess it's uh, everything about you and when you open it <clears throat> you see the profile, my profile photo and my last my last um, status update. Here I could uh, post a message and as you could see it will tell me I could post to Facebook and Twitter because I've added my, my accounts to Windows Phone. Unfortunately, you can't upload a photo with your message um, using this method. So also you could check in and set your chat status. If you swipe over, these are your notifications from your, your Twitter or Facebook. Uh, and basically these are mentions or uh, replies on your uh, status updates through Facebook and Twitter. Uh, to the next panel is what's new and basically these are your status updates that you've added to Facebook and Twitter. Alright, so another integration I want to show you is the pictures. So on previous phones like the iPhone, Android or other phones that I've owned, if I click on my pictures gallery, it'll show my, my photos and the photos I took. On Windows Phone, it's it's very different. So you open it up and here you see what's new and these will show photos from your friends basically so here's an example this is a photo that was posted on Facebook by my friend Stanley alright so the ne next panel um, you could go to albums these are actually albums that were pulled from my Facebook profile this is something new again and I, I really like it so let's uh, click on my photo album. These are photos that I took at the Philippines Independence Day Parade. Here you also have options to save it to your phone, use it as a wallpaper, or even add or view tags. I guess what I'm trying to show is that on Windows Phone, it's uh, there's an integration that's very different from other phones. I just got this Samsung Focus in today, and uh, I'm playing around with Windows Phone 7.5 just to see um, the user experience, playing around with it. I know this is, isn't a Nokia phone, but a Nokia phone isn't coming to the US until uh, 2012, so this Samsung Focus will do just fine until a Nokia Windows phone comes. So um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, thanks for watching.